everyone, welcome back to my channel. I forgot to film an intro for today's video, which is why I'm doing a voiceover one. Um, but it's basically a Christmas day and Boxing Day vlog. I really love this video. It's a bit chaotic and a bit manic, but that's just how my family are. Um, you'll see that as the video goes on. There is also some talking in the background of some clips. I apologize for that and we just have a very loud family. Um, but yeah, I hope you all had a lovely Christmas and I hope you enjoyed this video. And the video starts with mum and I doing the like Christmas food shopping waitrose and then it goes on to Christmas day and Boxing Day. You shall see. I'm I'm gonna stop this intro now and get on with it. Bloody, I look like Rudolph. <laughs> <laughs> Chef's kiss. Oh my god! Look at that bad boy. You not do my ID! <laughs> that is not a spoon for food. That's a spoon <laughs> for drugs. Can't get broccoli, mum. <laughs> I'm the last broccoli. <laughs> the last melon. <laughs> In the pizza aisle. Found the last broccoli in the pizza aisle because all of these fruit and veg are empty, but I found the last one, which is perfect. I don't really like the non-copyright Christmas music, so I thought I'd just do a voiceover for these clips instead because I didn't want to leave them with no audio, but I also didn't want the music, so just little random clips of some Waitrose things. This is what I wore because I love this Christmas jumper, and now we should be going back to clips of audio so I can end this awful voiceover. So red, so festive, I love it. <laughs> Christmas Eve sleepover, isn't it? We literally have a sleepover every night. Like, he just comes and lies in my bed every night. It's the cutest thing. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. It is 20 minutes past seven. I've been up for about half an hour now. I woke up at <laughs> literally um, 4.45, I think it was this morning. And I've just sort of been dozing almost since then. Um, I apparently am still a child and can't sleep on Christmas. Kind of can't believe it's Christmas today. But anyway, I'm going to get up and get showered now. Um, and get on the day. Important Christmas day outfit. I've got my dog Christmas pyjamas on and my house of CB dressing gown because we never really get dressed up on Christmas. We've always been like a wearing pyjamas sort of family. I might change into Christmas jumper and some leggings later so I feel a bit more dressed. But for now, this is my all important Christmas day outfit and I love it. Come on, pig in a blanket. Billy. Thank you. Billy is a pig in a blanket because he wears this blanket Oi. and he sounds like a pig, don't you? You make pig noises. <laughs> How many should I put on? Oh. Oh. I'm going to eat that too if that works. We'll be happy to put it back if you want it. Squeeze orange juice, baby. Bacon. Okay, people. I got these the other day. You might have seen it in the clip. Why does my camera just not focus anymore on what I want it to focus on? There we go. These. I have not had these in years, and I love them. They're the things that you get in a can, and I also got this yesterday from an orange juice machine. So it's a full litre of freshly squeezed orange juice, which is it's just perfect for me. So... Oh, and we also have some croissants that you would have just seen me put on and um, some bacon. Uh, we have our Christmas day in quite a delayed order compared to most families. Um, but I've got two older brothers, um, a dog that needs to be walked and everything. So we tend to like do our presents late morning rather than really early morning. But I quite like it. It makes the day sort of go at a nice pace. So breakfast now, presents chill lunch chill i knew i could see you in the back there i knew i could see croissants cinnamon swirls bacon uh, not bacon salmon from daisy's farm shop so it's bougie and fancy cream cheese maldi not quite bougie and fancy and some freshly squeezed orange juice mm -mm -mm. and this is the bacon as well again from daisy's looks quite nice to be honest don't really know what else to say about it bacon yeah and um, somewhere you know Okay, that doesn't look like anything on there. That looks disgusting. Why is it so yellow? Mm. Some of that pan is doing exceedingly hot. Mm. What? Oh my god! Golda! It's snowing! No! Oh 
my god. This is just, yeah, definitely. Yeah, this is what we needed this year though, isn't it? A white Christmas. Look, I can actually see it in my own eyes. Here you go, people. Last one, even though I've still got about 20 doors to still open. You want to do it with me? Ready, Billy? Are you ready? Oh, I can't open it. Ta da! <gasps> wow! Do you want them? You're going to take them for me? You take them then. I've still got all these doors to still open anyway. Because I haven't opened them. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Pull the corner of the red label down to the left. If you push it round, you're less likely to get that fold it on. Mmm. Ooh, ah. Oh, I'm trying to get the fold it <laughs> Right, good. Mmm, mmm. Good, I've got to put it up. Now it's got Big cup, oh, little cup. Welcome to our cafe. Fuck, I didn't put steam in it! You not do my editing! <laughs> what? We haven't done anything! You got it wrong! She's freaking me out! And now! Tea, cinnamon rolls, chef's kiss. Ooh, ta da! Look at all the presents. There's actually loads this year. I don't know why, like they're going all the way around, and I'm pretty, pretty sure this big one's for me, which I'm quite excited about. And this one um, is quite obvious as to roughly what it's going to be. Doesn't seem to want to focus. Um, but the fact it says Virgin Experience stays on it, I'm quite excited because I love presents like that. Uh, Going to be a bit odd if it's not that, but. Yeah, we normally, this is a conservatory if you can't tell, um, and we normally just like bring all the presents through here into the lounge and put them in piles because um, they're all labelled and it's one of my favourite things to do. Billy! <whistles> Billy! Hello! Knock, knock, knock! Billy! I can't get to any of the presents! Whose pile is that going in? Dad's. Right, Billy, put that in Dad's pile. No, not outside. Billy, you put it in Dad's pile. <laughs> you okay. go. Oh, we're gonna be here forever if he's gonna open it like that. Huh? Want this one or do you want this one or do you want? Oh my goodness, how much you got in here? What one? Yeah, he's after that one. Oh my god. This is now the current state of the lounge. It's an absolute mess. Oh, I'm standing on someone's present. Um, yeah. We've all opened our presents now and I just want to show you this one. Um, it's not actually mine, it's mum's, which is why I thought I'd show it now because it's obviously not going to be my what I got for Christmas because I didn't get it. Um, but it's just this book. I don't know if, let me turn you around, give me a second. It's this book basically of all the quotes. You know that like people share these on their Instagram stories of like the on the board things. It's basically a book of them all and it's so aesthetically pleasing as well. Like it looks so cute and colourful and it's just like all these inspirational quotes. I just thought it was such a cute little gift. So if anyone's looking to get someone a gift like birthday, whatever um this is such a cute one like a nice coffee table book i need to stop saying the word cute um but i just feel like well i was gonna say cute again um i just like it like do you know what i mean everyone shares them on instagram stories so i think it's quite nice to actually have like a little book of them so that's that but yeah we've opened our presents now i might get changed i don't actually know um i think we're just gonna big old stand i know loud but yeah we've opened all our presents now i think we're just gonna chill for a bit lunch is gonna be about two 
I think, which means it'll probably be at three. Um, but yeah, we've got turkey. Oh, my camera just, I think. I can't speak today. I've, we, <laughs> we've got turkey and beef, which is what we normally have. Yorkshire puddings, pigs and blankets, the classics. Um, Yorkshire puddings, to me, have to be on a Christmas dinner. I know some people don't agree with Yorkshire puddings on a Christmas dinner, but I don't agree with them. Um, but yeah, I think we're just going to have some, like, just chill for a bit, go for our presents. Like, um, we've all got kind of things that you can read or do things with so we're gonna have like you know just sit play with them whatever do you know what i mean anyway i uh, have some lunch and then i don't really know what we're doing with that after that we'll just wait and see i also feel like my skin looks really weird it's because i've got a bit of concealer on and my eye makeup but no face makeup because i can't be asked to put face makeup on on christmas i just want to like chill do you know what i mean i don't want to feel makeup on my face so if my face looks a weird color that is why ho ho look at that bad boy sausages are these Oh no. And some turkey. Mm, mm, mm. Here they are. Pigs in blankets. Mm, mm, mm. Yummy. There's a lot of pork meat going on here. You do realise that. Sausages, pigs in blankets, sausage stuffing, sausage stuffing. And then beef and turkey. And a bloody lot of potatoes as well. I don't know what it is about Brussels sprouts, but I just love how they look. Like cartoon Brussels sprouts, I'm obsessed with them, I don't know why. I don't actually love the taste of them. It's something to put the sausages in. Just the look of them. It's the sourdough that mum forgot to spray before it went in the oven. It's more of a, um, it's a bit like that potato Road bread. Roadkill. Roadkill, pancake, anything but a normal sourdough. To be fair, she wants me to say this, they are normally better than this. Insert picture in here. I would, you'll have to see one when it's done properly. There you go. But yeah, this That's is why she was having an absolute fit because of this. This is my pizza. We went out for lunch yesterday and I got it then. It's a Christmas dinner pizza. So it's gravy base. This is, yeah, we go. Cranberry sauce. I think that's stuffing and turkey. And then this is a brownie in there. That's not meant to be in there. It's not chestnuts. There's chestnuts on it. It's not. It is. I've just eaten one. Where? There's chestnuts on it. I'm telling you there's chestnuts on it. Apparently there's chestnuts on it. Anyway, that's what I went out for lunch with yesterday, but I didn't really didn't really do anything about that. San Pellegrino time. I feel like this is a classic Christmas drink. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if it's just me, but um, the blood orange one is my favourite. <laughs> I know the orange is a classic and the lemon, but I don't really like the lemon. And, oh, I've also changed. I've got my Christmas jumper on. <laughs> That was a good timing, you stopped there when I did. Cheers, everybody. Cheers, happy Christmas. It's the most important list of Christmas, this. It is. Look oh, at Samuel, they're these they're bad Samuel. boys. Mm. They are good. They are bloody good. So he's just got out of the shower, he's got his towel on. Yeah, got on them. Is it gonna? No, it's fine. Oh, yum, you put bacon on it. I do mm. one, one half. That looks nice. Okay, mm. just on one half. And then over here, broccoli, my beloved, the last broccoli, wasn't last it, mum? The last one in Waitrose. Some Brussels, what's in here? Leeks? Oh, carrots. So, uh, Chipolatas in Roast potatoes. In. Sausages. No, pigs and blankets, mum. Yeah. Mum has a tendency to call pigs and blankets sausages and bacon, which well, is just are. so... Yeah, but it's these boring. Are, these will be going in when... when Cranberry? What's this one? Cranberry? Uh, so we've got sage and onion. Cranberry, bacon, and onion. Sausages. Just plain sausages with no bacon on. Chef's kiss. Here we go team, it's the big moment. Stuffing, I've literally shown you this already I think, but it's now time to eat. Oh, looks good I That looks so good, why is it lumpy? Oh, because it's, it's got the carrots. <laughs> 0.25 what? milliliters of cranberry sauce. Oh, really? That's that is not a spoon for food. That is a spoon, spoon for, for drugs. What a go game, mother! <laughs> It is now. I'm just trying to get my phone out of my pocket to see what time it is. Um, 3.44. Uh, Mum and I are just going on a dog walk. They're just uh, coming now because we've just eaten and Mum and I are absolutely stuffed. So we thought we'd go on a walk just to get out. We were going to go on a walk this morning. Um, but Dad had already been and gone on the dog walk before we even woke up. So there they are. I'm going to do that now just to get a bit of air. You can have my if you want. It's a cook. 
absolutely bonkers. <laughs> it's literally like freezing. Oh yeah, Mary from the. I'm like, who's Mary? Mary and Joseph. <laughs> My ears are literally like in pain because it's so cold. Like it's, it's so fresh. Obviously, because it's snowed like probably like two seconds this morning. It means it's really cold. So I've got. Oh yeah, and ice on all the like puddles and ri not rivers. What do you call it? Ditches. Ditches. Um, it's actually freezing. The sky's really nice though. It's like um, purpley. Oh, well, it's actually orange over there. That's but purple that's over that's there, cool. orange over there. Oh my god, is it cold? It's nice, it's like fresh, isn't it? And like yeah. Christmassy, but oh my god, is it cold. This is the magical hour, isn't it? It's meant to be really good for Golden light, hour, yeah. yeah. So no one gets their selfies. And you know what? Nobody else is out. Come on, then! <laughs> Where's the bone, darling? You've got your roast dinner to have yet. Oh, Billy's still got his Christmas dinner! Yeah! Oh, that's quite moody. What I do look like. Well, like this is um, the queen in the crown because she wears like a head thing and a jacket like this. She's not listening to me. <laughs> She's watching the video of her throwing the straw about the sourdough this morning. Um, yeah. So yeah, that sourdough is uh, not very good. She basically forgot to. I can't you me. <laughs> she uh, forgot to spray it to make it That's steam so it's crispy or something. So it just. And apparently it was mine and my brother's fault because we were distracting her, but we were just in the kitchen having our breakfast. I actually can't take myself seriously looking like this. Um, we're just heading back now. I've actually managed to um, free up a bit of space in my stomach because, which is good because, I'm missing out half my sentence here, uh, because I need to have some room for some panettone and a lot of Christmas chocolate, like a lot. I need to have room for that um, hotel chocolate thing that mum bought. How many chocolates is in that hotel chocolate thing? How many chocolates is in? 130. 130. I think that's what she just said. 130 chocolates in it. But they're like all different ones. I don't know if I showed you earlier. If I didn't, I'll insert a clip in here. I need to have some room for that. And I've got some heroes at home, which are the best of the selection boxes. I couldn't get a tub of heroes because they were all sold out. So I just had to get like a little carton box thing, which is better than nothing. Um, top tier, crunchy bits, the new one. Big fan of that. Roses, absolutely worst of the of the tins. I had some of them the other day and they are just crap. This camera as well is crap it just doesn't focus anymore half the time i try and turn it on it doesn't turn on and the touch screen on it seems to have gone out the window which is fab cheers canon for that canon g7x's are amazing but they're also so sh because everyone says that they break after a while which is fantastic because i've not even had this a year anyway that's enough of me blabbering now mum's just taking a picture um i shouldn't have filmed a clip this long looking like this like why have i done that to myself um we're heading back now yeah we have Oh, there it is, huh? Dark. Yeah, it is getting dark. So yeah, we are heading back now. Got the panettone. I've gone for the chocolate one. We got two this year. One, oh, you can see it on the side there. Um, both from Rachel's. This one is the chocolate one, like I literally just said. And we did also get like a normal fruited one, but I just kind of fancy this one, even though I have literally eaten so much chocolate today and I shall continue to do so. Um, so it's got like a chocolatey top and chocolate inside it. And I'm just, I'm here for it, you know? I'm really feeling it. Oh my God look at this it literally just looks like a giant chocolate muffin okay it's hot chocolate time now i've got whipped cream i've got marshmallows i am literally going all out we've also just been on facetime actually still currently on facetime with my uncle who lives in new zealand who is coronavirus free and he was telling us what he's been doing this christmas we were partying last night off to the beach on boxing day which is today for them they're they're literally living the life that we all wish we were living can't relate anyway uh, i'm gonna make hot chocolate um that's that I've not had a hot chocolate like this in ages and I am so excited about it. I'm trying to organise them please into my favourite. Absolute bottom tier, the eclair. Crunchy, pinky decker, caramel, day milk, twirl, cream egg, whisper, fudge, eclair. These two are the worst by no. far. No, these are, I hate them. Swap that to where? That high up? Yeah. I hate fudge. I mean, though. obviously, yeah. these ones higher than those. We'll rearrange it then. And the eclair. Okay. 
because the eclairs are shite. I'm surprised they've made it to another Christmas in the box, to be honest. They should have gone years yeah, ago. Yeah, grandma's one, really. Yeah, but how many grandmas go out and buy a box of heroes? Not enough to warrant mm -hmm. it being in there. Hello puppy. <laughs> he's had a drink so he's got some water on his face. It's now bedtime. I am exhausted. I haven't really done much today but I'm absolutely shattered. Um, I think it's because I've been up for ages and I woke up at like half four because I was excited. Um, but yeah, it's now bedtime. Billy comes to bed with me every night. It's kind of this routine we got in in the past like two months or so. He comes and sleeps in my bed every night and it is the cutest thing. So yeah, anyway, that is Christmas Day 2020 over. It was a lovely day. I had such a good time and I hope you all did too. And yeah, I'm going to get into bed now and go to sleep and I shall see you all tomorrow. The same bit of salmon. Oh, got bloody, I look like Rudolph. Yeah. Got a red nose. <laughs> Dad's making his famous sausage rolls, which we all love, and I am sorting out the baked potatoes ready for, like, what do you call it, Boxing Day lunch? Is that what it's called? Boxing Day lunch. Oh, big one. Hot chocolate making station, and I'm gonna Don't have. Get the right champion, yeah. White chocolate Bailey's hot chocolate. Yeah. Dad's on TikTok. Not quite sure. Dad's sausage rolls are honestly my fave ever. They're literally like the best thing. I don't know why, but the way that he does them, he puts like Worcestershire sauce in them, I think, and stuff. It just, oh my God, they're just amazing. And this is mum's better sourdough. She remade one today because obviously yesterday's was a bit flop. Um, but yeah, there's no plates left either, which is why it's in a bowl. And the box and day lunch is ready, basically cold of everything yesterday, plus some um, Serrano ham. Mum basically did like the world's biggest hotel chocolate order and got loads. We've already got some of the ones, like the flavours in the lounge, oh my goodness. But I thought I'd get some more down. This is the bag that it all came in. And then we also got this massive box of stuff. I don't actually remember what flavours we got, um, but I'm struggling to do this with one hand. Um, Carol cheesecake, pink champagne, salted caramel. Oh my God, I think I'm gonna go for this one. A Rocky Road slab. There you go, a Rocky Road slab. And we literally have maybe like 50 of them, like loads of different ones. So I thought I'd just grab a few more and put them in the thingy. The thing we have in the lounge Tomorrow. and then i drove to josh's to spend the rest of boxing day with him and his family so this vlog kind of just abruptly ends there because i didn't actually end up filming anything else but i hope you enjoyed this video i really did um and i shall see you at some point soon with another one bye oh i've also changed i've got my christmas jumper on and my leggings and my dad <laughs>